with these new developments in the Casey Anthony case. NBC's Lilia Luciano is outside the Orange County Jail with the latest on this. Lilia, good morning. Good morning to you, Anne. And Casey Anthony is scheduled to walk out of here in just five days. And her mother, Cindy, who some legal experts had said might face perjury charges for her testimony, has just received word from prosecutors. And Anne, she will not be tried for perjury. And I started looking up chloroform. Cindy Anthony stunned prosecutors when she testified that she was the one who searched for chloroform on the family's computer. If those computer entries were made, then I made them. Forensic experts later countered her testimony, an That's apparent attempt to save her daughter from the death penalty. Now the I district attorney has decided Casey's mother will not face perjury no charges. It was about a missing child. On Tuesday, the investigators who searched for Kaylee spoke out for the first time. I certainly don't have any doubt. Um, we worked very hard on this case. We respect the jury's verdict. More than 140 law enforcement officers followed over 6,000 leads. They interviewed Casey, and she never told them the truth about what happened to Kaylee. She never said it was an accident. Uh, that would have been her opportunity to say so had it been. That day, this whole thing could have ended had we known the truth. The state of Florida is trying to force Casey Anthony to pay for the eight-month search, a bill that may add up to hundreds of thousands of dollars. And there are resources that could have been used to find other missing children. Meanwhile, the Orange County Sheriff is mindful of taxpayer dollars being spent in trying to keep her safe as she walks out of jail. We're not going to be her personal security. Her attorneys will make appropriate decisions and prepare for her own security after that. Now, once Casey Anthony reaches a secret location she'll call home, reports say she'll live in disguise and under a pseudonym as if in a witness protection program. And sources close to her say she's not planning to alter her looks with plastic surgery.